Need computer training for a group or office? Contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. You can use append queries as a way of copying and pasting records from one table to another table based on whether or not the records match a specified criteria. You can only append data from table fields to other table fields that share the same or a compatible data type. So for example, you may append a number field into another number field. However, you cannot append a number field into a text field. The more similar the two fields are, the easier it will be for you to append the data. Now if the fields have the same field name, the data is automatically selected to be appended into the field with the same name in the destination table. However, as long as the fields have common field sizes, so you don't lose appended data, and share the same data types, you can easily specify to which fields the copied data will be appended, even if they don't share a common name. You can specify into which fields in the destination table the fields from which you are appending will be placed when you create the appended query in Design View. Now to append only selected records from the original table into the destination table, you must use selection criteria in the appropriate fields of the QBE grid when you're creating this query. That way, only the records that match the specified criteria will then be appended into your destination table. So to create an append query, first create a query in Query Design View. Then click the Append button that appears in the Query Type group of the Design tab in the Query Tools Contextual tab in the ribbon. Doing this will launch the Append dialog box where you can select the name of the table into which you want to append the data from the Table Name drop-down. You can also select whether to append the new data into a table in the current database or into another database by selecting the Desired Option button. Note if you select the Another Database choice, then you will need to click the Browse button and then use the dialog box that appears to select the database file which contains the table into which you will append the data. Once you've selected the table into which to append the data, then click OK in the Append dialog box. You can then add the fields into the QBE grid that you wish to append into the table that you just selected. Next, click into the Append To row in the QBE grid and select the field in the Destination table into which you wish to append the selected field's data from the drop-down menu of Available Field Choices. In the Criteria row, enter the criteria by which you wish to filter the records which are appended if needed. Now after you've selected the fields to append and into which fields they should be appended, you can run the query to append the data. You will see a dialog box appear telling you how many rows you are about to append. If this is correct, click Yes to continue to append the selected records. If this looks incorrect, you can click No to abandon the appending and then double check your criteria. So here we appended salespeople and they went into our employees table. Note we also got a few blanks. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.